Okay, the partitioner has started. What we're actually seeing here is the disk of our computer represented in a sort of graphical format. As you can see, there's a sort of before and an after uh, simulation of what the, uh, the installer is going to do for us. So before I go any further, I just want to explain a little bit about what partitioning is. Now, some comprehensive information on partitions and what what the act of partitioning is all about is of course on the Linux Newbie Guide website, uh, linuxnewbieguide.org so please have a little visit along there um, after this if you have further questions they should be answered on there. Okay so on this example as I said before um, I'm simulating the fact that we have a sy system with Windows already installed on your PC and we want to add Ubuntu onto that so that we can have a system which contains Ubuntu and Windows and allows us to choose which system we want to start when we switch on our computer at the time of booting. So um, it's represented here that 18% of my disk is currently used by Windows and 82% of the disk could be used by Ubuntu. Let's have a look up here. It says before, 100% of the disk is being used. But why only 18% down here? Why is that? Because on our Windows partition, which this is supposed to be, we're only using 1.7 gigabytes of the full size of the disk, which is 10 gigabytes. Now I appreciate that's a very small disk. It's just for an example. But this is supposed to emulate the fact that we are using a small amount of space on our Windows disk, not all of it, and we want to resize that so that we can put Ubuntu onto uh, another part of the disk. Okay, now some of you might want to continue using Windows and Ubuntu and give a little bit more space to Windows and a little bit less space to Ubuntu, or maybe we want to make it half and half. You can do that just by dragging this bar out here. So they're about approximately 50% each. We'll do that. There we go, it's approximate. Okay, there we are. So what we have seen here is that we've dragged the space that we want to partition out to 50-50. Windows here, Ubuntu here, okay? And this is the easiest way to do it. You can use manual partitioning or guided, which in this option would just use the entire disk for Ubuntu. So use caution with that because obviously that means that it would wipe out your entire Windows partition and just put Ubuntu on your entire disk. And you don't want to do that unless, you, unless you're absolutely sure you never want to go back to Windows ever again. Now, before I go any further, press the forward button. I should point out, um, if you haven't already sort of picked this up by what I've been saying, this obviously makes some changes to your disk. Don't make any changes to your disk unless you're absolutely sure you've backed everything up that's important to you. So we'll move forward, click the forward button, it says before you can select a new partition size any previous changes need to be written to disk. So, okay. Now the disk's been re resized, this takes about 5 to 15 minutes really depending upon the size of your disk. It can take longer if you've got a really really huge disk like a terabyte sized disk. Um, it's all dependent upon how big your Windows partition is and how big your Linux partition is going to be and so forth. So this may take some time, really depends. So 